Hi guys, welcome to my channel. We have a guest host today, my lovely sister Emily. She's gonna be hosting the show. So tonight we are doing a snack crate. Um, I don't know if y'all have heard of it, but it is a monthly subscription where you are sent um, different snacks from countries um, to taste. So um, here we go. You ready? Yes. Okay, so. Ooh. Pakistan. Pakistan. I don't know anything about Pakistan. We have beverages in a spit bag, just in case. <laughs> okay, so the first one is a panda cake, an irresistible burst of flavor. This deliciously golden brown panda shaped cake is filled with a smooth and ooey gooey cr strawberry cream center. Ew. <laughs> It is not as cute not as cute. what it is on the Ooh, This reminds me of when you get like the SpongeBob ice creams and it's so cute on the picture and then you pull it out and it's like <laughs> So this is what it looks like on the package. And, and this, this is, is real life. You get real life. Okay. All right. And there's like no <laughs> strawberry in it. It's probably in it. Yeah. Oh, okay. So like rip it. There you go. Okay. There's okay. A strawberry. Okay. Meh. Tastes like the strawberry shortcake little Debbie's. How dare you? Those are way better. No. I don't. Anyway, these aren't bad. Not bad. Not bad. All right. Pretty so good, next though. is Novita wafers. Indulge yourself with some irresistibly crisp vanilla wafers sandwiched by a rich chocolatey cream that's so good you won't be able to stop eating. That's exactly what these are, little sugar wafers. Mm. It's really kind of flavorless. <laughs> Kokomo. Way down in Kokomo. That's what I thought too. Okay. A crisp and buttery biscuit filled with a sweet chocolate cream. Hearing fun graphics printed on the outside that look good enough to eat, literally. I got a sunshine. Okay. Mmm. <laughs> okay. I didn't expect it to be crunchy, but it does taste good. It tastes kind of like one of those car, not carnival brand, like the, um, the really cheap brand of animal crackers, but it's got chocolate filling in it. Say hi. <laughs> Chili chips. Mm, that scares me. Ooh. Looking for your next adventure in Flavor Town? Packaged with, <laughs> packaged with only the finest Pakistani spices, these little hot potato sticks are seasoned just right. They're like mini French fries. <laughs> it's so bad. So bad. That was awful. So bad. It tastes like burnt rubber. <laughs> if burnt rubber tastes like that. <laughs> Weird. <laughs> so you know how burnt rubber smells and that's how it tastes. Okay. Right. Next, Chocolato. I'm thinking about the chocolate things because it's like fake chocolate. It's, kind of... it's not bad though. Hmm. <laughs> this snack is the forbidden fruit of the cookie world. Sweet and crunchy biscuit surrounds a rich. <laughs> Center of chocolatey goodness. I'm so tired. Bodily function. I'm so tired. <laughs> <laughs> the lump can't get it. Oh, they look like those, those um, like Christmas cookies. You know what I'm talking about? I split one because they're gross. Oh, oh god! <laughs> it's filled with chocolate. That's Thank nasty you. looking chocolate. I'm not excited for this. Trash. Not a fam. Not bad, but not a fam. Not as bad as those potato sticks. 
That's right. They're watermelon jelly. Okay, so they're not Jiggles Berry, they're Jiggles Watermelon. Slightly sour gummies with a real watermelon taste, these bodacious bites will leave you with a taste of summer that can be enjoyed all year round. I'm excited for these. Really like taste like watermelon though? No? Those aren't good. Tastes like bathroom cleaner. <laughs> I expected that to be good. That was not good. Chocolate chip cookies. Okay. I okay. Think we can handle these. Watch them be awful. <laughs> Whether you need a sweet treat to snack on or looking or you're looking for something to enjoy with your coffee, these yummy chocolate chip cookies are for you. Freeze, should we get some milk? No. Ooh, they're like chocolate chocolate chip cookies. It sounds weird, but like it's like a chocolate cookie with chocolate chips. Not just a regular cookie with chocolate chips. Chocolate chips ahoy. But Pakistanian. <laughs> now we've got Jiggles Crunch. Don't do the Stop. Okay. With more crunch than jiggle, these sugary little gems are filled with bright color and fruity flavor for the ultimate jelly bean experience. Hopefully they don't taste like jelly bellies. I don't like jelly bellies. They look like jelly bellies. I'm just gonna do one. Mm. Ah. <laughs> no. <laughs> it's like licorice. Maybe one of the colors you got tastes mm. like licorice because the one that I had definitely tasted like tangerine. I had pink, orange, and something else all together. Red. Yeah. No, pink, no, that's orange, and yellow. Yeah. Mm. I want the blue it's like, it's like an M&M coating, but with a gummy inside. Yeah. Eating this mango delicious hard candy is like biting into a fresh and juicy mango while you relax on the beach as a cool summer breeze sweeps past you. Wouldn't that be nice? Bigger size, more but What the heck is a cool summer breeze? I've never heard of a cool summer breeze. Right? Maybe in Pakistan, it's cool. Why is there a red stripe through the middle of it? <laughs> the flavor is very accurate. It's not artificial. It does taste like an actual mango. I like mango. That's delicious. I might have to finish this later so we can move on, but I still want it. There are more. There are lots more. I think I can fold more. This tastes like a fresh mango, though. Next is the curly potato chips. Those sound good. Everyone knows that a crinkle cut potato chip is always um, packing an extra crunch. We've included either the ketchup or French cheese variety. We have the French cheese. Thank God. We've actually had ketchup chips in other countries and they weren't bad. Some of them, we've had them in different countries, several, and some of them were bad and some were not bad. Oh. But the French cheese sounds good. I mean, who doesn't like cheese or anything? Oh, my tongue's blue. That was such a small ball that you ate, too. Is my tongue orange? <laughs> okay. Mmm. Who doesn't like cheese anything? I regret saying that because those are bad. <laughs> Next we have wispy. <laughs> wispy wafer rolls. 
their strawberry. A big break from the usual chocolate bar. This delicate, delicate. <laughs> I'm so tired. <laughs> Texture of this crispy wafer filled with light strawberry cream. <laughs> A snacker's dream come true. <laughs> <laughs> Lick it. <laughs> it's been a long week, y'all. <laughs> Ew. Okay. Okay. Mmm. Mm mm. That is big yum. It's big knot. We have more potato sticks. I don't want those. But they're lemon and chili. A Pakistani staple. These smoky potato sticks boast a pop of tangy lemony zing mixed with a dash of chili spice, leaving your mouth watering for more. I wonder Doubt what would it. be in a U.S. box. I think we've talked about that before. Probably like Oreos and Doritos. And Cheetos. <laughs> Hershey's. Coca-Cola is probably the drink. Oh. They look the same. They smell better. Ew! higher hope for that. <laughs> mm. If I could chance, Stan needs to learn how to do chips. That's bad. Okay. Their candy ain't bad. Okay, this one is literally called... <laughs> I'm scared. Now chocolate paste. So what did it used to be? Wake up your morning with some added decadence. <laughs> The sweet chocolate paste has a, a delicate taste, perfect for topping things like pancakes or waffles. Okay, so it's basically like chocolate syrup. Should we syrup. make toast real quick? Put no. it on toast? Okay, pause. Good idea? Go. Cheers. It's just chocolate. And burnt toast. <laughs> I kind of like it. Burnt toast and all. This is called Prince Chocolate. These crumbly cookies feature a layer of delicious chocolate cream, making them ideal as a snack, a dessert, or an accompaniment for coffee or tea. Do you want to split one or? Yeah, let's yeah. split one. Ew. Okay. They weren't lying about the crumbly part. Just like a, it looks like a Ritz cracker with chocolate. Yeah, pretty much. Mm. Those, Those are, are good. good. <laughs> <laughs> we saved this one for last because it's gum. So, like, it'll last forever. Obvi. I mean, like, not, not forever. forever. But, you know, whatever. Jinx again. Okay. So, this is berry. It looks like the little gummy things. I don't know what they're called. I don't know, you can't really even see them, but there's like gummy candy that looks like this. This like bumpy. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> gum there is not the same as gum here. I think these are gummies. Yeah, it's gummies, but it definitely says fruit flavor gum. They're not bad though. Yeah, but that's gummies, not gum. It's not a bad flavor, it's just a weird texture. Yeah. Because of the It's like a hard gummy. It's like the outside is almost like um what's it called? The fish eggs? Saga. I can't want to say nori, but that's the paper. <laughs> so that's all. It's not too bad. I'll give it like a seven out of no, like a six out of ten, maybe. Some things were good, some things were not so good, but they do candy well. They do not do chips well. Yeah. yeah. 
I don't think there's much of anything I'll be finishing except for the chocolate prince was good, prince chocolate, whatever. The strawberry wafer things were good and the mango little hard candies were good. But other than that, I think this one was the best. Oh, the chocolate wasn't bad. The chocolate just spread. Just like chocolate. Wasn't bad, but. The mango candies were definitely my favorite. Chocolate chip cookies, not too bad. But yeah, definitely all the chips, the potato sticks, the gummies, the wafers were kind of flavorless. The strawberry panda was good. Yeah, the strawberry panda was good. I don't remember what this was. Those. Oh, all the different chocolate cookies and stuff. Or like, like the chocolate filled cookies were meh. But anyway, okay, that's all. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, hit the bell for notifications. I don't know where stuff is, so I'm just gonna point. <laughs>